Hello everyone, welcome to Easy Fix It Academy. Today we have got MacBook Air A1466. So let's power on the device. As you can see, nothing happens after pressing the power key. Let's connect the charger and press the power button again. As you can see, there is no green light or orange light. So let's open the device. After opening the device, as we can see, the PCB looks quite clean. There is no watermark sign on the top side. Let's test the power supply circuit. As we can see, the power supply circuit it looks normal. So let's open the logic board. After opening the logic board, as we can see, there's a caps which looks nasty actually, which looks quite bad. And rest of the PCB looks clean. There is a little bit watermark on the register as well actually. The SMC area looks clean as well. C7710 is connected through the PP5E underscore S0 rail. So that rails comes through PP5E underscore S4 RS3. So that is the main power rail after the standby circuit. So as we can see the C7710, there is a V in, there is a standby power voltage for the light IC. So let's test the C7710 as we can see we are testing on the diode mode as we can see there is no short to ground but that caps looks very bad let's replace the caps After placing the caps, uh, there are two registers actually that was a bit corroded due to the water actually. So let's reinstall that register as well. After installing the register, we are going to install the logic board and test the MacBook. After connecting the charger, as you can see, there is an orange light and the fan is spinning. So, let's put the back cover and turn on the device. As you can see, the device is back to normal and it's working perfectly. This is how we work at Easy Fix It. If you like this video give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button and bell icon for more exciting videos. Catch you up in the next video until then stay happy keep learning.